Officials of a major gas company have opened Tokyo's first commercial hydrogen filling station. This follows a Japanese automaker's launch of the world's first commercial fuel cell vehicle, or FCV. Governments and companies across the country are going ahead with plans to create a hydrogen society. NHK Rail's Jun Yotsumoto has more. A ceremony on Thursday celebrated the completion of the first commercial hydrogen filling station in Tokyo. The facility will be used to fill up fuel cell vehicles. It is able to fuel 50 vehicles a day. A fill up takes about three minutes and the car can travel 650 kilometers. A Tokyo gas official says the operating cost will be about the same as gasoline powered car. The government contributed about $1.6 million in subsidies to build the facility. With this as a start, we want to accelerate our joint industry government academia effort to realize a hydrogen energy society. Japan's automakers are world leaders in the development of FCVs. Toyota started selling the world's first commercial FCV on Monday. And other major manufacturers are unveiling plans to sell FCVs during the next few years. An FCV is powered by electricity generated through a chemical reaction between hydrogen and oxygen. It emits only water, no carbon dioxide. That is why the FCV is called the ultimate eco car. The Toyota FCV has a top speed of 175 kilometers per hour. Engineers say it took more than 20 years to develop the next generation car. They must ensure that it runs reliably under all weather conditions. The biggest problem was that the water it emitted could turn into ice in very cold weather. They also developed lightweight carbon fiber fuel tanks strong enough not to leak. After decades of starts and stops, FCVs are ready to hit the road. But there's one more wrench in the plans, a lack of hydrogen filling stations. The government has offered financial assistance to build hydrogen stations. So far, 45 applications have been granted. About 20 new stations are scheduled to open by March of 2016. But some are criticizing this as not being enough. One of the biggest challenges is the cost. It may take time, but all related operators must continue to work steadily to spread the stations nationwide. Many believe the realization of a hydrogen society holds enormous potential for Japan because it will reduce its dependency on imported energy. The spread of FCV fueling stations may be the first step toward Japan emerging as a new resource power. Junior Tsumoto, NHK World, Tokyo.